Hello, Dern here the Power Week. And I'm going to do a random play game. Yeah, the game with a Slender Man, but more different one. How did I come across this one? Well, I was in EAW chat and talking with people there, and someone said they like playing the Slender games and so on. He told me about Slender Elementary, and so I got into wanting to play it. I was like, yeah, you know what? So, yeah, you know what? Let's try this out. So here is Slender Elementary for you. <laughs> I'm pretty interested to see how it works myself. Elementary. It really has no Slender in its name, it's just Elementary. <laughs> elementary School. Blackbird screen. And we're greeted with a flashlight. And we have to find eight teddy bears. That's the funny part. Okay, now I have to say that ambient is more scary in this one. It's more worth. It's for what is worth is better than this is the normal slender one. This light, I'm not sure what's with it, to be honest. Is this supposed to be a school by any means? Okay. Uh I guess this works. Let's see select it. And so the flashlight broke, I think. And here's the thing. In Slender, uh there's you are in a night you are a night in a forest. But here it looks like it's daytime. We just forgot to run that out. I'm not sure. Anyway, it seems that she walks more panicated now. Let's see, does it work? Whoa. You can't hide. Well, I guess that's right. I can't really hide. And that's a weird... Um... I'm back in a corner. Um... Uh, <laughs> this is the most silliest thing ever. Like, look at it. Oh. And I have those screen shakes, like, it really, it really puts on the fear factor, you know? For what is worth, it's more scary, that's true. Really. And the Slender Man's control better, so. Let's see. Going back where we started from. Hmm. This looks to be a outside the school. Whoa. Oh my god. Okay, so this is a bigger place to explore. There's blood there, as I can see. Gross. <laughs> Keep out. Uh, then I will assign you up in a school. But yeah, come on. Let's see. Is it here maybe? Huh? So, for what it's worth, it's a good game. <laughs> it's not really more scary, it's just the same Slenderman thing. Three teddy bears. The music's changed logically. <laughs> um, I'm starting to think that this thing. Oh, that's gross. That like a human head. Okay, I'm I'm more excited excited about this game now. Everyone brings something slender then. Those weird and creepy meanings on the walls, yeah. Good, good. Still blood. Okay. And... I think these are people that play the game. That play Slender Space Camp or something, I... So that friend of mine said he was nice to me. And he got 
do five pages, but I'm part of his takes a hand and still so I can it. So and then I decided to be a douchebag, so he lost the game as five pages. Um Is this supposed to be more interesting than the first Slenderman? It is more interesting, like you see the bodies and so on and blood, gore and etc. <sighs> And you see how the start of the game tells you you have to collect teddy bears. Well, now you have to collect pieces. Yeah. And the pieces look like teddy bears. <laughs> Interesting enough. All I can say is that, yeah, it is a good game. Only problem is not supposed to be scary. I mean, it has some scare factors into it, which makes it good and really more deserving than the first one in my game. But. Not really that much. It's just a simple game. And honestly, I went so quickly into it to five pieces. And the game decided <laughs> to be a douchebag. Oh well, that's it. And anyway, I'm the Profit Thank you for watching. Hope you turn on for next time.